Hi, this is Behru Rahman and welcome to SS My Team SMB Solutions. In this demonstration, we will explore how to produce PDF documents from your files or folder in your Windows Explorer using File to PDF application. After you have installed File to PDF on your system, if you right click any file or folder in your Windows Explorer, you'll see this new PDF entries in your context menu. To instantly produce a PDF from any file, for example, a Microsoft Word document, just right click the file and press Instant PDF option. What this will do is produce a PDF in the same folder with the same name but with the extension PDF. Let's try another file, this time a JPEG image. And the PDF file with the same name is produced instantly. You can also produce multiple PDF from multiple files, all in a single click. This definitely saves you time and effort. To output the PDF to a different location or maybe change the PDF size, you can use the advanced PDF menu option. What this will do is allow you to customize the PDF file name or choose your custom output folder and set page size say A5 and portrait or landscape orientation and maybe watermark the PDF with your, your company name. and as well as set a password typically you'll find yourself dealing with different document types such as Microsoft Word, PowerPoint, Excel, JPEG, PNG, GIF and other emails formats and even archive files, emails, files like MSC and EML and so on. With file to PDF application, you need not worry about the file format anymore. Here is a list of many file types it support for direct PDF conversions. As we know, a compressed zip file contains multiple files and typically we extract the contents of a zip file to a folder before we can view or work with the inner files. With file to PDF application to produce PDFs directly from a zip file, you just right click it and click instant PDF option and this will convert each of the embedded file within the JIP to their own separate PDF documents. If you want to combine all the files of this compressed JIP to one single PDF file you can do so by pressing the advanced PDF option. Here you choose the combine all to one PDF option. You can customize the file name. Let's continue. So here is the one PDF file that contains all the files of the GIF.
A multi-page TIFF is an image format that can have any number of images in a single file. File to PDF application can easily produce one PDF document containing all the pages of the TIFF file. Just right click and select the instant PDF option. As you can see, the one PDF document contain three pages. You can also produce separate PDF document for each page of the TIFF file through the advanced PDF option. Here choose to save to separate PDFs and let's continue. So what it does is to output each page of the TIFF file to a PDF document with the same name but with a page number. Many of us have emails stored in disk in the form of MSC or email files. File to PDF can produce PDF documents from these email files and their attachment. Just right click the file and click instant PDF option. So here's a MSC file which has three different attachments. And by default, the app will automatically convert the attachment to their own PDF files apart from the email. So effectively, you'll have one PDF file for the email and as many PDF documents for that many number of attachments in the email. If you want to combine all attachments and the email messages to one PDF document, you can do so from the settings. Choose the second option, merge emails and attachments into one PDF file and save. So now let's try to create a PDF document from this MSC file. As you can see, only one PDF document is produced and the first page is the email message and there are three attachments. And if you go to the second page, the Excel sheet, the Word document and the PowerPoint presentation all merge to a single PDF document. Let's try producing PDF documents from a folder that contains multiple files. So I have 12 files in this folders and to produce PDF from this folder just right click it and click instant PDF option. This will convert all the files under this folder to its own PDF files. If you want more control over the PDF output, you can use the advanced PDF option. For instance, I want all the files from this folder to be combined to one PDF. And I want the welcome page document to be the first page on the combined PDF. So I can just drag the file to be on the first preference. You can rearrange the sequence of the files by using this button up and down. And I can also rename the file 
do something like project tour and let's continue and I have chosen the welcome page document to be on the first page so here is it here is a PDF document with one page at times you may have the need to add new information to your existing PDF such as project updates, fax reports, or simply scanned documents. With file to PDF, it is a simple step. Just choose the files that you want to add to an existing PDF document. Right click and choose the append PDF menu option. This will prompt you to specify an existing PDF document from your DEX to which the chosen files will be added to. Let's choose the project.pdf file which is located in the same directory. So no matter what file types you have selected, file to PDF will convert all to PDF before inserting as new pages to your existing PDF file. To email files as PDF, right click the files under Windows Explorer and click Email as PDF option. File to PDF will automatically convert the selected documents to PDF attachment. File to PDF can produce PDF documents that are watermarked with your company brand or logo. Just right click any files and choose the advanced PDF option. To put a watermark image or text annotation to your PDF file, click the watermark option. You have two options on how to create a watermark. First you can use an image such as your company logo or you can use a text as watermark let's try your company logo as watermark confirm here is your PDF output and here is what it looks like in your PDF reader now let's try with the text watermark Let's say I want to use my company name and use font size to say N6 and I want to rotate at minus 45 degree and use the color say dark gray. Confirm and continue and let's see how it looks like. As you can see my company name is embossed on the PDF on each page. With file to PDF, you can lock down your PDF content by setting password encryption and limited file permission. This is available when you use the advanced PDF option. Now click the security if you want your users to enter a password to be able to open the PDF content, check this option, require a password to open the document and specify a password. You can also check this option, restrict editing and printing of PDF. This adds another level of security to your PDF content. For instance, you want to allow others to print your PDF content. So you check the allow printing option. 
as well as you want to allow annotations and lastly you can also specify a master password so that in case you want your team members to perform unrestricted activities on your PDF material they can do so by entering this master password now let's produce the PDF and open the PDF as you can see the PDF applications require you to enter a user password so you have a PDF which is secured with a password if you go to file properties and security you'll see that it has certain restriction as a user you are allowed to print and comment